Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video and today I'm going to be going over the 20W14 Infinite Update. This is a new update that just came out for Minecraft, the latest snapshot, and it adds a whole lot to the table. So unlike my April Fools video that I released earlier today, this is an actual update for the game and it's released by Mojang so it, it's uh, permanent and here to stay forever. So yeah, it adds a lot of things such as new dimensions and some new blocks and items and some new features so let's just get into it. So first of all, they have the old dimensions like the nether and they have that still so you can look forward to uh, going to the nether and end. Those are permanent to stay. They've added two new blocks like the block of uh, the box of infinite wood and that comes in various colors as you can see. I think one of them might be green or blue. So yeah, they've added these and if you right click on them, you can get what essentially would be an infinite set of books. And uh, each of these books have 16 pages and they have random nonsense, which probably is code for something, but maybe I don't know. Anyway, they've also added the uh, new dimensions, like I said earlier, and uh, they've also changed the inventory here. So everything is randomized, um, as you can see, but most of the categories are in the normal order. But yeah, this basically is, I think, like a really good change that they did. So instead of having them in um, ID number where stone or dirt would be first and then, you know, goes down the list, They've made it random, which I think is a good idea, just so people can explore new block ideas, maybe find new palettes that they wouldn't have otherwise thought of. But uh, yeah, I really like this. Um, all the things stay in the same categories, such as uh, miscellaneous, so you can uh, find new mobs maybe if you uh, wanted to. Find new uh, dyes if you weren't uh, aware of them. Diamonds, you know, next to bats. So uh, yeah, if you want to go to the new dimensions, you want to go ahead and make one of these. I don't know if there's a crafting recipe. I didn't look, but there will be a change log in the description down below. And um, yeah, so you want to click on one of these books. Let me actually clear out my inventory. Click on one of those books and then head into your nether portal. And I believe you can just throw it on there or yeah, throw it onto your thing and it'll change color. And then if I hopefully walk it right in, it will summon a new dimension. So as you can see now, our new dimension is made out of these fancy looking things, our uh, infinite uh, books, blocks, it uh, has grass at the bottom, no lighting, which is a little unfortunate, so let's try getting a new one. I don't know if we have to build a new portal or not, but I'm not going to try that because that takes a long time. Let's make a new one. Alrighty, and then that makes something new, I would assume. Yes, so now we have a new biome, and this one's made out of basalt, um, which looks like basalt in all directions, made out of these pots, and then what else do we have here? We have green concrete, and then a bunch of stairs. So as you can see, this is actually a really cool addition. Looks like we do have trees in this biome, which is really useful. So you could almost survive, technically, in one of these things. Looks like we have very mountainous terrain here, and I've already lost my nether portal, which is pretty cool. And it looks like they do spawn certain mobs, depending on which dimension you get. Looks like we also have fossils here, by the looks of it. It looks like we do have fossils, and they do spawn in ore. So you could almost survive here if you, uh, if you got the right dimension. Well, let's just check out some more dimensions here. Um, all we have to do, I'm pretty sure we can even do it from the uh, this way. So if we just grab a book. We also have other blocks here. So I think if we, there we go, we can do that. And then we hopefully get a new dimension, yeah. So instead of spawning back in the overworld, we spawn in here where we get end stone brick walls, pink wool, a bunch of geometric shape looking things, floating islands. I think these are meant to represent end islands because they are made out of the uh, end stone bricks. And it looks like in this biome, Endermen spawn, which is very convenient. Uh, so you can get around a lot faster. And it looks like there's maybe more things over here. I really like these half circle uh, end things here. They're really nice. Uh, gives you more ideas for building. And uh, yeah, it looks like Endermen and spiders spawn in this biome to my knowledge. Sandstone circles, uh, half circles over there. Let's try another dimension. We just pull out the book and then grab that and then throw the book in there. And then now we get a gray biome where the portal looks gray. And it looks like we have carpet world with fossils. So I'm pretty sure they have, I guess by the title of the update, an infinite amount of biomes. Or to be more specifically, it's like the, I think the eight bit or the 16 bit integer, which is about like two million or two billion or something. And this one, this biome that we're in, or this, uh, let's see here. What biome does it say we're in? Uh, does it say biome generated? Uh, and then it says the number right next to it. So yeah, this one spawns in weather skulls, which could be interesting to farm. And I'm pretty sure, if I'm not mistaken, if we just head back to our overworld, which I think we can just do by that, and then head back in here. 
Oh, alrighty, so the uh, portals didn't save. So that one goes there. And so it looks like you would have in pretty much an infinite series of portals, which I was not expecting. Um, so let's see how far we can get here. So keep putting in that. That'll go there. And then ooh, this one is very interesting. This one has packed ice, which is green, I guess to some uh, degree. It looks like the lighting might change the thing, but we have packed ice. And then it looks like normal mobs can spawn here as well. So yeah, this is uh, this has been the um, 20W14 Infinite Update Snapshot. I really hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, a like would be greatly appreciated. And I will see you in the next video. Have a nice day. Bye.